Hi everyone, this is Massimo and today we will talk about sportive eyewear frame. Time ago I bought this Chinese sportive frame online and it came with like four interchangeable lenses. Fast forward one year, <laughs> the frame is broken but I still have these four interchangeable lenses sitting in a box. So in the end I thought to reuse them in one of my projects. So I slowly start thinking about it, gather some ideas. While I was sketching something else, I got the idea and I got the design for this sporty frame. After a really fast remodeling to understand the dimension and the proportion of this frame, I got enough information to start the final remodeling. That took me around two hours. From then, I started thinking about the 3D printing part. The 3D printing phase was not really straightforward because I had some difficult 3D shapes that sometimes were failing the 3D printing or printing not as I intended. But I got to the point where all the parts were 3D printed. After a quick dimension and quality check, I moved to the metallic filler to close holes, correct imperfection and to get the final frame ready. The process of metallic filler sending took me about 2-3 days because I repeated these steps 4 or 5 times till I got the result I wanted. Then I started with primer and really fine sandpaper. So this process was repeated 3-4 times in order to close all the holes of the 3D printing and fill in the gaps between layers in the 3D print. After the primer sanding phase, I was ready to move to the color phase, but first I needed to cut the lenses and try the fitting of the lens in the frame. I did this by 3D printing the dummy lens. tracing on top of the normal lens and cutting the lens with a saw. Quick check of fitting of the lens. So I moved on the painting phase. At this point I already had a rough idea of the colors I wanted to use in this project so I just went to the locker store, bought them and I was ready to paint. I masked the different parts, I painted first the blue part and then the black part and finally this is the final result.
this project took me a long time but I learned a lot from it and I'm really satisfied with the final result. That's it for this design project. I hope to see you guys with the next video and if you like this video please subscribe. If you don't like these videos please give me a thumbs down but write in the comments how I should improve this content. See you in the next design video.